The mackerel is a fish in the Scombridae family. Specifically, researchers place mackerels in the subfamily Scombrini, along with tuna, Spanish mackerels, and bonito. They place the true mackerels in the Scombrini tribe, which contains a total of seven species in two taxonomic genuses. Description of the mackerel. Members of this group have elongated, torpedo-shaped bodies. Their caudal peduncles, or the area just before their tail fins, have an incredibly narrow shape. This helps the fish move swiftly through the water. The different species grow to different lengths, and have different colors and patterns. Most have a silvery coloration. They range in size from 8 inch to 24 inch. Long and weigh between 1 and 7.5 pounds. Interesting facts about the mackerel. Each species has its own unique traits and adaptations. Learn more about what makes a few individual species unique, below. The first one, Atlantic mackerel. Also known as the Boston, Scottish, or Norwegian species, people often catch this species in commercial fisheries. People sell this fish canned, fresh, frozen, and smoked. In fact, these fisheries catch approximately a million tons of this fish every year. The second one, Indian mackerel. This species has a much stouter bill than its Atlantic cousin. Again, people rely heavily on this species as a source of food, particularly in India and other parts of Southern Asia. People often prepare the fish, by removing its head and digestive tract, and frying it whole. The third one, blue mackerel. Another species with several fun common names, people refer to this fish as the slimy, Japanese, Pacific, or spotted chub. Researchers used to believe, that this species was a subspecies of the next species on our list, but genetic analysis showed the two as separate species. The fourth one, chub mackerel. Unlike other members in its genus, this species possesses a swim bladder. The swim bladder helps the fish remain neutrally buoyant in the water column using air and gas. A neutrally buoyant fish does not sink or float, so it can easily navigate the waters around it. Habitat of the mackerel. Different species in this group have different specific habitat preferences. Some prefer tropical regions with warm waters, while others live primarily in temperate zones. Most species prefer coastal habitats near the shore, but utilize pelagic ecosystems within the water column, rather than remaining near the bottom. Distribution of the mackerel. Each species has its own unique distribution and range. Some live throughout vast regions, while others occupy just a small area. You can find various species throughout tropical and temperate seas worldwide. Their range includes the Pacific Ocean, around the Indo-Pacific Islands, the Indian Ocean, and the Atlantic Ocean. Diet of the mackerel. Again, each species has its own unique dietary preferences. Different species in different size fish hunt for different prey. However, most feed primarily upon plankton, krill, small crustaceans, detritus, and small fish such as anchovies. Many species hunt via ram feeding, in which all of the fish in the entire school swim with their mouths open, engulfing prey as the school swims by. Some feed as a school, and some break apart into smaller groups to feed. Mackerel and human interaction. Humans utilize several different species in this group as food sources. Many different commercial fisheries target these fish. Climate change also impacts the survival rate of eggs and larval fish. This activity impacts each species differently. Some species have large populations, and human activity does not significantly reduce them. Others decline due to human interaction, or populations in specific regions suffer. Domestication. Humans have not domesticated these fish in any way. Does the mackerel make a good pet? No, this fish species does not make a good pet. They swim in large schools and move constantly through open water. This makes them a poor choice for your home aquarium. Mackerel care. Aquariums keep some species in this group. They house them in large tanks, often circular in shape, with strong currents to keep them moving, and deter them from running into the sides of the tank. They keep the fish in schools, as they would naturally occur in the wild. Their diet typically consists of small fish, krill, missed shrimp, and similar prey. The behavior of the mackerel. Regardless of species, all members of this group have social behavior and live in large schools. They live active lives, swimming in search of food and moving quite swiftly. The schools form based on the size of the fish. Larger fish school together, and smaller fish form separate schools. Reproduction of the mackerel. Breeding usually occurs seasonally, and the timing varies based on the species at hand. Reproduction occurs via spawning, where fertilization happens outside of the body. The females release a batch of eggs, and the males release their sperm to fertilize them. The number of eggs produced varies based on the species and size of the fish. A single female can lay hundreds of thousands of eggs in a season. The eggs float freely in the water until hatching into a larval fish. Cool facts about mackerel fish. First, 1. What type of animal is a mackerel? 
Mackerels are species of fish that are found in the northern parts of the Atlantic Ocean. The second one, what class of animal does a mackerel belong to? Mackerels belong to the family Scombridae under the class of Actinopterygii. The third one, how many mackerels are there in the world? Mackerel is a fish species which neither stays close to the surface, nor ventures in very deep waters. The population of this fish species in the North Atlantic Ocean has recently increased to 57 million. The population of Scomer scombris or Atlantic mackerel is the largest among this. The fourth one, where does a mackerel live? Mackerels are pelagic fish species and they are commonly found in tropical and temperate waters. They are found living along the coast and the oceans, and these fishes are migratory in nature. They are found near the surface while in migration. They stay near the surface mostly in the days, but at night they move into deeper waters. Atlantic mackerel prefers to spend the warmer months near the shore, but soon as the winter months start to settle in, they move to deeper waters. They move more towards the south from the north, to stay in warmer waters. Fifth one, what is a mackerel's habitat? Mackerels are mostly found to be living close to the coast. They prefer habitats along the coast as they are pelagic fish species. They are largely distributed along the coast of the North American continent. The North Atlantic Ocean is the most common breeding ground for these fishes, but each of the fish species has its own specific range. For example, blue mackerel are found in the waters of the Pacific Ocean. Atlantic mackerel is one particular species of this family that is very common in the Atlantic Ocean, especially to the north. King mackerel, on the other hand, is a species that thrives in the Gulf of Mexico. The sixth one, who do mackerels live with? Mackerels is a fish species that are found to be living in large schools along the coast. They are quite a social fish species and have active lives. They hunt for food in these large groups and move through the waters very swiftly. These large schools are formed on the basis of fish size. Bigger fishes stay in separate groups than smaller ones. The seventh one, how long does a mackerel live? A mackerel is a fish found in the northern parts of the Atlantic Ocean. These fishes are known to survive long in the wild, living up to 25 years. An Atlantic mackerel is known to survive for at least 17 years in the ocean. The eighth one, how do they reproduce? All species of mackerels are oviparous. They are found to be migrating in their large groups to a suitable breeding or spawning ground. This movement takes place along the coast as these mackerel species do not spawn in deep waters. They have a preference for spawning in shallow waters as eggs laid by the females tend to float. At one time, the females can lay a large number of eggs. This number varies between 300,000 to 1,500,000, but also varies according to the species. A female Atlantic mackerel can lay around 450,000 eggs in a single spawning season. Their season of spawning is spread across the spring through the summer months, and can occur both day and night. Ninth one, what is their conservation status? The mackerel is a fish that is found mostly near the surface of the water, making them easy to catch by fishermen. Although these fishes are largely hunted for their rich taste and high protein value, most mackerels are tagged as least concerned by the IUCN red list. The blue mackerel, the Atlantic mackerel, and even the king mackerel are all tagged as least concerned. These fish species are found in abundance throughout the North Atlantic Ocean, although they are now impacted by climate changes. To date, there is only one type of mackerel that is considered to be somewhat threatened. Among the tribe of Spanish mackerels, the Monterey Spanish mackerel is considered to be vulnerable. So, today we are talking about some details about mackerel fish. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more videos.